Okay, so I'm gonna be explaining Gateway Skip, Planet Skip, whatever, with Mario 2P. You can do this 1P as well if you get enough height, but it's very hard and I wouldn't recommend it. Uh, so I'm gonna be doing it with 2P. Um, it's very hard for me to keep my hands inside this, like inside like the camera's view. So I'm gonna try my I'm gonna try my best, but it's probably not gonna be in like the frame every single time but what you're trying to do is getting a triple jump and on the last uh jump of the triple you're gonna uh you're gonna click the camera fix which is this button you, well it's gonna be this button for you but it's this button for me because i switched them around so don't get confused with that this button's what you're gonna press so you press that like as soon as you're about to land the third jump, you're pressing the camera fix, and then you're holding A, and you're getting that uh, mega triple. It may sound weird, but like once once you get it first time, it's gonna make sense. Um, so I'm just gonna go for it, and then I'll try explain um, how to do it. I probably won't get it first try. It is a hard trick. I haven't fully learned how to get it very consistent yet but i'm gonna try my hardest to stay in view and get it so we'll do that now so like this right there i got it so i'm gonna go back and explain that all right It's gonna be uh, attempt number two. I'll try get it first try just to showcase it. What happens when you get it first try? How like the camera angle looks, but it's kind of the same concept. I'm just trying to like keep my Joy-Cons in like the frame. All right. Okay. So you're kind of okay. I'm just gonna explain this really quick because you kind of, kind of, you kind of land on, kind of wanting to land on exactly where I'm standing, right? On this kind of slope, this kind of slope, right? You're gonna want to land your last jump on there, and you want to obviously get the mega by doing a camera fix, like exactly what I'm doing right now. So hold jump for a bit. I'm gonna try a show like this. All right. This is so awkward trying to like do, but I'll try to do like this. I would have been near, I swear. Cause my my can our hands just naturally like they're naturally trying to go away from the camera. Just because that's my natural position, but There we go, got it. So, when you're going for that, when you're going for that uh, second jump, so when you're when you're going for the first jump, right, you want to be like up diagonal when you're going for that first jump. But then, as soon as like uh, you're like mid air and you're about to land um, from that first jump, you want to switch like. Not like diagonal top left, but like up and then like a bit to the left. You kind of just want to like have that. So when you're starting to jump, you're going like that. Then when you're like mid, like uh, during the jump, you want to be like always holding the analog stick up and a bit to the left. Not like full diagonal, but like up to the left. And if you do that, um, you should get in the right position. Obviously, sometimes um, you won't get it. But... That's just how this trick works. It's very inconsistent. Um, this is like the most consistent way for it to do it with Mario. Um, and this was found with Tibbs as well. I thought I couldn't. I thought I should mention that. And you're holding A a bit on the first jump, and then you're tapping A and tap and holding A on, again on the third jump. And obviously, you're doing the camera fix, which I show I did in the the jump. You're doing that camera fix as soon as you're about to land on a third jump. So you're doing the camera fix, getting the jump. I can kind of show it, right? 
as an example. This won't, you can't get a mega from this, but yeah, I can show. See, that's what I'm doing. Like, you see uh, this finger right here? Watch. Like, I'm pressing the camera fix as soon as I'm about to land that f last jump, right? And that's how you get the mega triple. So, I think that's everything. It is a very hard trick, so I shouldn't even be using it. I don't even have, like, a good enough time to be using this. Like, I should only be using this if I was going for world record, right? So, if you don't have to use it, it does save, like, around 20 seconds. No, it saves, like, 18 seconds. Or the, uh, yeah, it saves, like, 18 or 17 which is a lot of time, but if you're not comfortable with doing it, don't do it yet. It's not really that important. You can get away with not doing it and still get a really good time. So, yeah. Hope this helped, anyone. And yeah, thanks for watching.